everybody. Thank you so much for stopping back by to my channel. Thank you everyone for all your likes, everyone that subscribes, the comments. I appreciate you guys so much. And let's hop into this video so I can explain to you this merge glitch for anyone that's having just total brain farts about this. They don't really know what's going on, why it works, what else can you do with this glitch. I just want to show you a couple of things in this video, give you an example of what this does, and also include some exceptions and items that aren't going to transfer using this merge glitch. So as everybody knows, the director mode glitch got so much more complicated now that we can merge items together on the male character. I haven't found that hot ticket item that you can transfer from the male to the female to just go ahead and merge these items on the female without doing it backwards and not having equal and opposite components. But for now, this is working pretty well for me. So basically what you're going to do is you create an outfit on your female character that has a merge item. The merge items are either a top, um, pants, or shoes. For this video, we're going to focus on the pants. So if you're looking for a pair of pants that allow you to merge other pairs of pants onto specific shoes or to certain tops that you can't normally get them with, this is the video that you're going to want to watch. It will explain it more to you and you'll kind of understand exactly what this does. So the pants that allow you to merge pants onto any outfit are these new style of leggings here. You'll see that I have these orange leaf leggings on. Most of the newer style leggings do work, but I have tried a bunch of them. These ones have worked every single time for me. So just keep these on your list of the leggings or the pants that allow you to merge pants with any outfit back and forth. These are just, they work. Believe me, trust me, these are the ones you want. So obviously you can get most shoes with most pants on this game. For the female character, however, there are certain hot ticket items that you can't normally merge together. For instance, you have skate shoes with stockings, which I love. I'm so happy that I found those components and I'm able to show you a billion different ways to put these items together. I know that the girls have been waiting to be able to do that without having to buy a modded account or anything like that, especially because they're not transferring anymore. Other items that you can't normally glitch together might be sandals with stockings. Um, just, I don't know, any random pants, like say you wanted to put, I've shown you Tron shoes with joggers, or you wanted to put the high top canvas shoes with joggers, things like that. So these items you cannot normally put together if you don't have a modded account, right? So the director mode glitch has have allowed us to put a lot of these items together just by knowing the components or having the components. Unfortunately, I haven't totally completed my component list there are so many more sections that I need to go through and I definitely need to do an update. So if you don't want to sit around and wait for that, this is a great way to merge items together without knowing the components to be able to create the outfit that you want. The other cool thing about this is sometimes you get items like these blue sports shoes on the female character. When you transfer these over to the male character, they turn into a checkerboard item. So technically they do not have a purchasable or opposite component that you can put on the male character with something like the stockings to transfer back over to your female. But because we can now do this merge glitch, you can put on these shoes with the merge pants, and then you can merge stockings with these shoes to make an outfit out of them. I know it's a little confusing, but I'm gonna show you here exactly what to do. So what you need to do first is select the shoes that you want. For instance, I'm selecting these blue sports shoes. You can also do, say, black skate shoes, which I've been getting a ton of questions about that, or pretty much any other shoes that definitely have a non-invisible opposite component on the male character. Let me say that one more time, a non-invisible opposite component on the male character. So if you're thinking about doing something like the high top canvas shoes, the Tron shoes, biker boots, things like that that do not have purchasable opposite components, this is not gonna work for you. Simply because you can't put those shoes on these pants. You can't just buy the shoes to put them with this pants. Hopefully that makes sense to you. But again, items like the blue sports shoes, the black skate shoes, say the jeweled sandals, um, the loafers, things like that that you wanted to wear with the stockings. So you want to put these new like orange leaf and green leggings on with the shoes that you want to transfer with the leggings on slot number one. It's very important to put this on slot number one because this is going to merge the items together. Then you want to select for outfit number two, the style of leggings or the pants that you want to merge with these shoes that you have in slot one. 
So I'm going to show you here something that I love, which is stockings with any kind of sneakers or sports shoes. The weird thing about the stockings is only four of them are transferring for now. You've got the nude, the red, the white, and the black. So you have to be very, very cautious if you're just testing this out back and forth. I chose the white stockings. Save that on slot number two. So now we have two outfits here, and we're going to do the director mode glitch to transfer these items over to our male character. So what normally is going to happen after you do the director mode glitch for your male character, you'll spawn into your closet or in your interaction menu, and you'll be able to see the outfit slots saved one and two. You will not be able to click on these outfits, but as long as you see the numbers there, you know they're saved, and now we can go ahead and merge the items together, merge the outfits together. So to do this, we're going to online, jobs, Rockstar Created, versus, and we're starting a job called Crooked Cop. What this is going to allow us to do is merge those stockings on outfit number two with the merge pants and then the blue sports shoe component on outfit one to create this cool little bottom here. So when you get into Crooked Cop, go ahead and go to player owned clothing, set that, and then go and invite anybody. I guarantee you're going to get a ton of people trying to join this job because everyone's doing this merge glitch or they're just using Crooked Cop to be able to view those outfits that they couldn't view simply in their closet or their interaction menu when they spawned in after doing the glitch. And this can happen sometimes too if you're doing invisible items or you're just testing opponents to see what transfers. So there's another tip for you for everyone that's kind of getting into the director mode glitch and the merge glitch. When you spawn in where you select your outfit, scroll down to current outfit, scroll over to two, back to one, and then hit ready to play. It's hard to see here, but you just merged outfit two with outfit one, and then you're ready to go. When we spawn in, you'll see these components actually merge together, and then there's one more step to take in the job before we quit it and are able to do the director mode glitch again. So as soon as the other person hits ready to play, we should be good to go here. I tried scrolling out a little bit to see if I could see anything else on this outfit, but unfortunately you can't. Kind of sucks, I know, but it's all good to go. So you're going to load in to Crooked Cop, and you'll see that you have the white stocking component, which is the classic ivory suit pants, with the blue sports shoes component on the male, which just so happens to be checkerboard shoes. Like I said, you can't purchase them, so how on earth could you possibly put them with the stocking component here? Do Crooked Cop. So another important tip and hint that I want to make is anytime you have a checkerboard item, if you add a regular mask, it will glitch the checkerboard item away. So just standard thing that I do is I open the interaction menu, go to style, accessories, gear, and I just go ahead and add a rebreather every time I'm doing this merge glitch, nothing will glitch away. So pop open your phone, quit the job through your phone, and then you'll load back into a session near ammunition and you'll see that you still have those stocking components and then the shoes that you merge together on with the rebreather. All you need to do now is head to ammunition, a clothing store, your apartment, Honestly, anything that is the closest to you is where I would go and then save this outfit. Because this does have a checkerboard item on it, I'm not going to tamper with the outfit at all. I'm just going to go ahead and save it with the rebreather on it. You can try to take it off for items that don't have checkerboard pieces with them. It's really okay to take them off. But these checkerboard items are so fickle, I don't even waste my time taking it off. The cool thing about the rebreather is it is a equal transfer kind of item. So if you have a rebreather on your male, it will transfer a turn into a rebreather on your female, as long as you have that unlocked and purchased on your male or your female. So I'm saving this outfit here in slot number nine. I'm saving it as pants because I wanted to just remember and remind myself that this is how I merged pants together on my male character. And now we're going to complete the director mode glitch to transfer these, this outfit or these items back from our male character over to our female character. And hopefully it works. I'm pretty sure it does, which is why I made this video, but I know sometimes it's not going to work for you. So if you're just testing, doing trial and error, check it out. It's actually a lot of fun to do if you have time, especially if you can figure out something really cool that you've always wanted. So this is what I've always wanted. I've always wanted these blue shoes with these white stockings. So many ideas in my head to do different shoes with this item here. Really excited about it. So as you can see, outfit one was the actual shoes with the merge pants. Outfit two was the white stockings. And then I created this outfit here that I saved on slot number nine that now has the white stockings and the blue all sport shoes. So what you can do now is create your outfit. 
most tops will go and not glitch away the stockings or the shoes here. And that's the case for pretty much any bottoms or tops that you're wearing together. Most of them will not make any changes, okay? You can also add components on the outfits before you transfer, like a different top. I always do a white tank top because I know that it transfers to the male. And if I wanted to do something else, I could do that. But this is just to show you that the bottom and the shoes glitch together, which is the most important part here for this video at least. So you can add pretty much any top to this outfit after you transfer back to your female or in the first go around, you can add any top, pretty much any top to the outfit if you wanna kinda of play with it back and forth as well. You can add any accessories, you can change the hat here. The only things that you can't really change are obviously the stockings or the pants. And then also you don't wanna to try to change the shoes or anything like that because that was kind of the point of doing this whole glitch. So I do want to say thank you again to everyone that has liked my videos, that has subscribed. I love all the comments. I really do love helping you guys, and I appreciate all the questions. I know I cannot help every single person every single day, so I try to be as detailed in the video and the description as possible. Check the comments too. You guys are really good about helping each other out, and I really, really, really hope this explains this little merging pants a little bit better for you. I have more videos on the merge glitch coming out and hopefully you guys enjoy it. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'll see you soon.